Hey, today I was thinking about a time when my daughter and I went to see somebody over in Asheville. And um, she had no trouble getting us to Asheville just fine. She has no trouble getting me to any place that's far away. But when we got to the neighborhood, it was like... <laughs> It was like not going to happen. She couldn't seem to slow the car down in time to see the turnoff. So we'd go zipping on past the road this way. And I was like, Jamie, Jamie, just turn around, just turn around. She'd go zipping back this way. Jamie, just slow down, just slow down. You know, it's like the more, you know, I'd try to tell her to slow down. It seemed like the heavier her foot would get on the accelerator. And the more impatient and aggravated, she'd get zip, zip. Finally, the girl whose house we were was going to actually came down to the side of the road and was waving at us. Jamie still wanted to go zip, 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 zip. She just couldn't seem to, to gather the strength that it would take one to go slow when we were really close up. Like I said, now on long distance, she's perfect. <laughs> but anyway, I've noticed this in other people too. I've noticed that some people, I think they can do fine whenever they set a long-term goal and whatnot. But then when they actually get closer to it, sometimes they forget maybe to shift gears and to slow down and to take a look and see what's going on around them in order they don't overshoot maybe what they're looking for. It's a good thing to have a long-term plan. You should definitely do that. But you really got to pay attention to what's going on right now right here. Your guide may be standing on the side of the road trying to flag you down, but if you're not taking time to look around you, you'll probably just run right around them or over them or whatever and not even see what they're trying to show you. And your job really isn't, remember, to stare at your guides for a long period of time, but just to be on the lookout for what they're guiding you to. You know, if you look at them, you miss where they're pointing. So, Set a long-term goal, that's great, aim for it, but slow down and pay attention to what's going on right now in the short term to make sure you don't miss where you need to, to turn off the home.